In the name of Allah, the entirely merciful, the especially merciful, may peace, mercy and blessings of Allah the Almighty be upon all of you. I am Umar bin Abid and you are watching Umar Linguistics. So in this video we are going to discuss clause POS tagger or clause parts of speech tagger and uh, we will come to know that how to tag data with clause tagger and how to analyze it with different corpus tools like and con. The same video is available in Urdu as well. I have provided the link in the description below. Uh, moreover, you can watch videos on other corpus tools as well, like AntConc, TagAnt, and File Converter, and File Splitter, etc. On my channel, I have provided all the links. So, first of all, uh, open your browser and just write clause tagger. So uh, sometimes clause tagger does not open at some places or at some locations. So for this reason you may uh, use a VPN and Opera VPN is good for that because it is by default in this browser and then you may open this. So here is uh, the introduction and then accuracy they have discussed its accuracy and template tagging, tagging services, tag sets, tagging guidelines. You may click on this word tagging guideline and then you may come to know that how a word is tagged and if there is ambiguity. So ambiguity tags are like this or which tag will be chosen if a word is ambiguous. So first of all, uh, for now, uh, we are going to tag some data. So just click on free clause www tagger. When you click on this, so uh, you can choose to have output in either the smaller C5 tag set or the larger C7 tag set. Because uh, here you can see that there are two tag set C5 or C7. First of all, you have to select the tag text or tag set and then you have to select uh, the output style horizontal or vertical or pseudo xml and then you will paste your text so one thing here uh, that the limit for pasting the text is 100,000 words uh, if you uh, put data more than 100,000 words so it may uh, uh, it may not but it will not tag, tag your data so up to 100,000 words uh, mean that maybe sometimes even it will not tag your data if it is even 90,000 words maybe so before this uh, just open C5 tag set and C7 tag text so just we have a brief overview that what is the difference the difference is that in C7 text uh, uh, tag set we find uh, more categorization as compared to C5 tag set so you can see for example if I choose this one plural after determiner comparative after determiner for example one may say comparative after determiner means more beautiful more beautiful mean uh, because more is uh, uh, like uh, or you can say the the more beautiful the more beautiful so in this way so you can say superlative after determiner so it has a lot of categorization on the other hand in c5 tag sets there is not much categorization as compared to c7 tag set like uh, for adjective there is only one for comp uh, for uh, you can say positive or unmarked adjective there is only one tag aj0 and ajc ajs for superlative so uh, why there are these two tag sets so it may appear or mm, you want to find a feature and that tag is not appearing in c5 tag set so you may switch to c7 tag set so therefore uh, these two tag sets have been introduced uh, now we are going to uh, tag some text so first of all we'll tag with c5 tag set 
so I'm just writing a line a beautiful cat in the garden and I have selected a horizontal style and tag set is C5 now tag the text so here you can see the data has been tagged and this is just the mark of punctuation uh, if you want to know any of the tag so you may copy all this stuff and then you may paste it in excel file or word I have already paste the C5 tag set so now uh, if I look at uh, what is the AT0 the determiner so if I look in the tag set then this is AT0 article uh, they have not made the distinction or they uh, do not have uh, they haven't give the title of determiner to the because you know uh, it's not more comprehensive or in more detail as compared to C7 tag set where in C1, uh, C7 tag set if we tag the same uh, data with C7 tag set now what will happen and now we're going to choose vertical what is vertical and what is horizontal you come to know the difference so this is the difference now this is vertical so now uh, in C7 tag set uh, the is tagged by AT so if we see that what is AT so it is article here as well similarly JJ beautiful then NN1 cat then in is tagged by II and then percentage is also given so this information that uh, why uh, wh what is the mean of slash then 99 then RP at slash 1 uh, you will come to know all this stuff in, in this tagging gu uh, guideline alright so in this way we can choose C7 tag set and uh, similarly sudo XML uh, what actually what happens in uh, sudo ta uh, XML that wor every word is given an ID as well so now you can see that uh, every word has been given an ID like 2.1 the then 2.2 the beautiful cat in the garden Uh, now I'm going to tag a little bit you can say a larger text in horizontal output style with C5 tag set and now I'm uh, copying the tag uh, the text from brown corpus from newspaper section control V tag text after tagging you just have to copy all this stuff copy and then make a notepad file open it once again control V then control S and I'm going to give it the name of tagged text by clause alright in desktop it has been saved now I am opening antconc file then open file or simply control F then tag text by clause you can save your file anywhere in the computer and now I am opening it the file has been added go to file view just to make sure that the file has been uploaded clearly then go to cut cordons and for example we just write a j you must have to write in capital the same uh, in the similar way in the same way as the tag has been given now you can see the concordance so in this way uh, you will find your feature which you want to find in your text
so you, you know first of all the word will appear and then its tag will appear inadequate overall superior primary relative relative widespread outmoded accepted term recent for possible ambiguous so in this way uh, similarly you may find it in concordance plot in context for example if i click here so i may find that fulton superior court judge the wood pile so i have already uploaded all the videos about and cock and how to analyze the tag uh, ta any text in and cock so uh, this is all about today's video i hope you would have understood how to use clause tag clause tagger clause pos tagger so don't forget to give your feedback uh, remember in the prayers zakalo khairan and thank you and you may subscribe my channel if you have understood this lecture or this video or this tutorial 